Hey everyone, this is T Bone PDX, and today uh, we are back on the Minecove server. Now this is not what you're used to seeing on the Minecove server here. Um, that's because I am on the Creative server right now. Uh, this thing is right here because I needed to change the biome. Oh, it stopped raining. Oh, nice. Okay. So. Give me a second. Okay. So, this is my creative plot. Um, and I just wanted to do some building here with you guys. Because I thought it would be pretty interesting. Um, and then maybe hop back on to the survival server after a bit. So... This is what I've gotten done so far. I think it's pretty good so far. I mean, it's not like the best, most award-winning um, thing in the world. Um, but yeah, uh, it, it it's definitely pretty cool. So we're just gonna do this for a bit. I might time lapse this. I think that would be interesting. Um, here, let's just throw this across. Okay. I don't want that because I want the windows. And there. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, that looks good. So, I'll just do that on the other side too. Um, yeah, this is it so far. There's like a garage area here. And this comes out under the stairs. Stairs come up here. And yeah, so that's that, that's it so far. I'm just going to do some more work off camera. Okay, so I've uh, done all of the exterior and uh, interior framing here. Um, I got the place looking pretty nice, but it's boring. It's very plain. No detail, so... We're just gonna add some detail here. So let's get our detailing blocks. Uh, let's see. We're gonna want red tulips. No. I want white tulips for this. And ferns, I think. Um, just to make it look nice ish in front here. Just sort of throw these all over the place. And it's already looking much nicer here. Um, th this front area is quite detailed, so I like that. Um, maybe over here, let's add. Let's grab some grass and trap doors. Have the trap doors. Here it is. Okay. So, maybe like some planter boxes under the windows. Just some more detail like that. And then we're not going to want to use um, we're not going to use the uh, white tulips for this. I think we're going to use the uh, blue orchids because they look really nice. You can't drop items. <gasps> no. <gasps> wow. Okay, I didn't know that. Um. Anyway, blue orchid. There we go. That kind of clogs the window a bit. Okay, let's replace that. 
and throw those in. How does that look from the inside? I'm scared it's gonna be I'm scared it's Oh, I actually really like that. Yeah, that's nice. Um So maybe let's No, no, this area is nice. I like that. Um Maybe over here we could do a planter. That might look weird. Um, doesn't really line up, so. Looks better, maybe like this. Okay, let's try that. Um, and line this with blue orchids. Um, what else should be more detailed? Let's grab our fences. Maybe throw some along the edge here. Fences look pretty cool. Um, maybe even out the corners like this. And then just throw them in here too to give it some structure. Not on the top, actually, because that complicates things with the roof. Um, yeah, this is looking much better. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Uh, and then maybe on here as well. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That, that, that definitely looks much nicer. Um, and now I'm going to take this path pattern here. And um, sort of copy it uh, to go out a little, and then also make it come out of the garage area. Um, like this. I'll also add some of these plants here too. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Okay, so I've got the paths. Uh, sort it out here. Um, it's looking considerably better. Um, we also might want to add a fake chimney, even though we don't have a fireplace, you know, yet. Uh, I might add one. So, the key to chimneys. Um, I actually have no idea. I don't have a lot of experience making them. Uh, I just usually like to go up like this and make a nice thick chimney here. Um, then make it go up like a half block just to make it more interesting. Um, ooh, yeah, yeah. Um, maybe I could even... Or, or wouldn't this look dumb? Gosh, I'm not sure. So, I'm thinking maybe go like this around. Well, first let's see how this looks with the slabs. Okay, that that does look better. Um, but I was mostly thinking just doing this with the stairs. So, how would this look? Let's do that, okay. So this is just, just gonna be like a path area. That's nothing special. Uh, but this, I maybe wanted to make a little garden. Oop, wrong block. Uh, have it like loop around and then have one main attraction. That's the key with gardens. You have to have a lot of main things to well, a, a big center point to look at, um, and then a bunch of little things around it to sort of add to the detail. Um, not that I would, not that I would know, but you know, uh, I just came up with that right now, actually. 
Uh, so let's see, this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Awesome, so I'm just going to finish up this path. Okay, so what I was thinking is continuing the pattern of ferns along the edge. Um, maybe even throw in a little white tulips there. Uh, like so. Uh, just to add some variation. Or maybe that would look better with the blue orchids. Yeah, yeah, I like that better. Okay. So we're gonna go orchids. Blink, 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 blink. Orchids. All right. Four, five, six, and then the two orchids, and then the corner piece. So yeah, yeah. That. Hopefully this looks good at the end. Um, be pretty sad if it doesn't. No, no. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like that. Yes, that looks really good. Um, so let's see how much space we have to work with here. I was thinking we could do like... Um, one, two, three, four. Like planter boxes like this. Um... And then a fountain. So, I'll maybe make these planters right now. Okay, so I've sort of cleared out a rough idea for like the basin of the fountain. And I've also made these things here, like I promised. So maybe let's add a new flower this time. I really like these azure bluettes. Quite nice. They remind me of popcorn. Um, ooh, I forgot to truck door here. Let's make sure to add that. Otherwise, it would look a bit stupid without it. Because I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna put that back now. All right. So, a uh, good thing to have with fountains is odd numbers and unfortunately I didn't think it through enough so we have even numbers let's see what we can do here maybe like this I'm definitely gonna add more detail to this okay but just for now let's grab our water though so maybe we could add some detail um, I also want these uh, all to be source blocks right here like that cool um, and let's grab our stairs and slabs and see what we can do here spirally patterns like that no no I don't like that maybe what we could do is have one of these on top I doubt it'll look that great <laughs> then why did I do it okay I do have an idea though I think this will be better so we go like this and then like that, and like that. Cause it sort of goes with the fountain's uneven theme. Oh no, I messed up. Okay, let's grab this water. And we still want that in our hot bar. Okay, so what do we want? We want that. Do we want that?
Hmm. That looks a little weird. What if we invert that? Like so. Ooh, and then we do this. Um. And then switch the angle of those. Sure, sure. It, it's nice, it's abstract and it's pretty cool. So, yeah, I guess this is our build area. Oh yeah, one more thing, the interior here. Um, what do we want to do for this? Um, we can't do one of those piston tables, even though I want to. And I added this area. Um, let's grab the interior decorating blocks. Like I like using anvils, definitely. Oops. Actually, no, I do want some of these leaves. So then we can grab a birch fence. Uh, this is one of my favorite things to do. Um, I'll show you guys that later. Well, hopefully pretty soon. Grab some of these. What do we want to display? Enchantment tables actually make pretty good decorations. What do we want to display in an item frame? I do love my redstone. Um, but I also really like swords. Let's do an iron sword. Because it looks... Well, it goes with the theme. Um, oh yeah, the chandelier. I, I don't know if I showed you guys this. Actually, let's add some trapdoors to this really fast. Just to make it look that much better. Fold them up. And again. Hmm. Okay. All right, almost done here. I'm sorry you have to bear the pain of me doing this on camera. If we were in true 1.9, I would be able to do this. The server is compatible with 1.9, but it's like not on 1.9. So yeah. All right, let's get to work here. So, throw an anvil down there with like a Uh, ender chest next to that, maybe just like a tool smithing area, so let's break that, put that there, no, it doesn't, let's grab a furnace, I do love my furnaces, furni, I don't know, okay, there we go, so this is, let, let's move this anvil over one more block, as well as that, um, okay, so now we are going to want to grab some wooden slabs right here, and this also works with uh, tables and stuff, but let's grab our birch, and let's grab our dark oak, and we go like this, and like that, and it's a, like, bonsai plant. Um, that's the trick I was going to show you guys. If you already knew that, sorry for the, uh, anticipation that you already knew the thing was going to be. Okay. Can I please... Oh, wrong item. There we go. One block painting like that. We could also maybe do a computer... No, wrong time period. Let's throw a poppy in here. Just to give it a nice bright color. Um, 
I'm contemplating, should I make this a bathroom or a pantry? Hmm. Let's make it a pantry so we can add cake. Um, or, <laughs> or we can make it both. Um, no, let's not do that. Because that would be kind of nasty. Okay, maybe let's throw some rabbits. No. It's a pantry. What would be in a pantry? Um, well, flour. So, like, wheat. But also sugar. Yeah, let's do sugar. Um, and hang that on an item frame here. Like that to show it's the pantry. Um, throw down a few chests, too, because, you know, you need some storage in your pantry, or else it's kind of a lame pantry. Maybe even an under chest. And let's grab our cakes, our beloved cake. Here it is. Cake is, like, the best in the world. So... There's that, and it feels like it's maybe missing something, like, I have an idea, let's see, where is our normal doors, the first door in Minecraft, here we go, wait, no, I want this diamond because it's special, okay, so we're gonna go up like this, ooh, but no, we can't here. Here, let's move this torch and this ender chest. Um, nope, that was wrong. Okay. So we kind of need to be on top of that. There we go. Makes a sort of, like, cabinet. It's very cramped in here. I mean, it is a pantry and whatnot, but, you know. And then so I had one more thing here. How about an apple? Because, you know, it's kind of... Sort of iconic. Not really. But, yeah. It's an apple. It's a pantry. And I think that is it. Now, I just want to figure out something really quick here. So I'm going to pause. Find out what happens next on the next episode of Mine Code.